Hey guys, it's Louise here and welcome back to my channel. So today we have episode 5, 5 of The Rings of Power and I am very, very excited. Things have started to heat up a little bit um, and I'm very intrigued to see where this episode goes. I hope we get to see a little bit more of The Stranger this week. Uh, we didn't get to see him last week. I do hope we get to see, obviously, more Elrond. Uh, more Elrond and Durin, because I fucking I love them so much. Um, and yeah, I, I, I'm intrigued to see about, obviously, Galadriel being escorted back to Middle-earth. Uh, obviously, like, Isildur and all that kind of stuff are gonna go. Um, and obviously, this is kind of gonna bring things together just a little bit more. Um, I don't know if we're going to see any more Adar, if we're going to see any more hints towards Sauron, because, you know, everybody is Sauron at this point. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. I'm just excited. Okay, so I'm going to try an entire new layout for this. It's not entirely new for you guys. The only difference is I'm going to be facing this way to watch instead of facing this way. Usually, my monitor over here has the show on it. This one has my OBS and stuff on it and my camera. Um, and usually I'm kind of sat, like, turned um facing this way and that's not good that's not good for my back at all um literally the cripple is making herself in more pain um so i'm gonna try out having everything else over here but having the show here so that i'm kind of like here and i can look at the camera and you know i can focus fully on this um whereas when i kind of turn around to look at my camera after watching this i'm always like distracted by obs and i'm always like looking down and checking if everything's right and looking at myself and all that kind of stuff so i'm gonna try this out if it looks weird, I apologize, but we're just rolling with it. Oh my goodness, are we going back to the stranger? Yes! I hope he's accepted and I hope he becomes their friend. You're not a terrorist. I'm gonna cry. It's good. You are good, you're wonderful. Good. You're good. I swear to God, if this show hurts me with him, I'm actually going to be so angry. Please, he is good. He will always be good. He has to be. Others should be ready by now. Come on, you can do it. Come on. Makes me sad that she doesn't have her family there with her, like, little cart. The sun is fast falling. But I mean, Nori's basically her family now, so. Okay, my entire body just is filled with goosebumps right now. Like, my entire body. This is stunning. Holy shit. Why is this making me emotional? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> you know what? The other Harfoots may not give a shit about them because they're really fucking shitty. But at least they have each other. This is so wholesome! Not only wander are lost! <laughs> He's... Oh my god, I'm gonna cry over a fucking song because it said not all who wander are lost. <laughs> Fuck. Hello? Okay. Everyone is screaming, it's Sauron! It's Sauron! I don't think it is. Adar! Hi! My love! Love of my life, hello. It is, time. it is time for what? That per the the per orc. Like I've never felt bad for an orc before until now. Like he's just so like careful with them. Like last week when he was like helping the other one that was dying, and then he's just burning this one's arm. I'm surprised they were so quick on that. Oh, shut up. I mean, to be fair, standing and fighting Sauron is not... It's not something you do so casually. One does not simply fight Sauron. Oh my god, the theme songs for Numenor, for Numenor are so fucking good. Oh, the horse on the crane! He's floating! You could ever hope to accommodate. Half the city wants a spot on those boats. He's just gonna sneak on if he doesn't get given it. He's getting to the front of the line. Yeah, he's gonna sneak on. Well, I'd have died. Please, give me ants. Give me ants. Give me, please. I don't like it here. Oh, it's okay, dear. Is that a warg footstep? They're wheels and leave 
them. Oh, you silly bitch. What's it gonna take? They're so ruthless. Somebody or an orphan? I do not like this woman. I don't like the Harfoots except for the ones that we're following and Lanny Henry. For now. Depending on his decisions. That doesn't look safe. Is it a wolf or is it a warg? Oh, Jesus. Fuck, that jump scared the shit out of me. Holy shit. Oh. Whoa. Let's go, Gandalf, who's not Gandalf, but I'm going to call him Gandalf. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. Best boy, let's go. Teach them Galadriel. Come at me. Come at me, bro. The man thinks he's all great. Like, oh, I can beat this female elf. Of course. Oh, what was that? Ooh. God, she's so fucking cool. Oh, that was a nice move. Oh. 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 Oh, is Halbrand going to challenge her? Nope. Oh. That was a spicy move he did, though, to get that sword. Dude, he's 100% the most interesting character in this whole thing. Nori, no! Oh no, don't don't look like that. Why do you look bad? No, stop. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. No, I'm I'm not. Please. Just let him be a good wholesome boy. Elrond! Bit sudden for elves, no? Well, did he just pull out of his beard? People weeks just to decide to take a shit. If I may. Oh god. <laughs> The hand of time crawls so slowly for light into the tree to protect it. On they the do love their trees. Morgoth, channeled all his hatred into the tree to oh! the oh! oh, that's sick! Holy fuck! Forging of their conflict. That's such a tricky situation to be put in. Like, yeah, they're your own people, but he's your bestie. He's your bro. El oh god, oh, don't do it, Elrond. Don't do it. Don't pull it out like that, Elrond. What will that do, though? How will that stop all this that's going on? Like, them knowing about the Mithril? Like, how will that stop this? I don't really know what Mithril does. Like, what would that do to stop all this? Like, why is that so important? I hope you find something that you would be willing to sacrifice anything. Well, I mean, take care of Beric for you. I promise. Beric's gone. Is he setting fire to the ship? Oh, dude, what the hell? Oh god, this is bad because you're gonna get in trouble for this, Isildur. Oh god. Idiots, man. He's gonna get in trouble for that, isn't he? Or he's gonna be seen as the hero for either like saving him or admitting that he was the one gonna burn it down. And then they're gonna let him go on the ship. <laughs> See, he's a good boy, now take him on the ship. Fit. So he's... Makes me wonder if Gil-galad's in on it and he's just waiting to see if Elrond sticks up for his friend or his people. Me. Or maybe he is just being deceiving. But now our people are doomed unless I break an oath. Elrond, do not break that oath. Let them go find it for themselves and they won't have to break your oath. 
don't know how I survived. How we all survived. Did he kneel to Adar? Is that what Halbrand did? Come on, Halbrand. Come on. Sauron. You are Sauron, are you not? Uh, the entire fandom <laughs> is him. Elves are just like the light of Lord of the Rings, of everything. Oh wow, he's putting his trust in him to show him that? Holy shit, that was a... That was a... unexpected. Is that in the shape of, the, of Sauron's mask? Holy shit, that's so cool. Oh dude. Give me the meat and give it to me raw. <laughs> Whatever you say. I love how he's trying to make himself taller. I... Why are you lying? Why? Oh, I see what he's doing. Gosh. He wants them to freely, willingly hand it over. So that he doesn't have to break the oath. I have... He's just passed the entire fate from himself over to him. He's like, I don't want to break my oath, so you do it for me. Oh, no, he was listening! Was he listening? With his elf ears? What's your elf ears here, Gilgalad? Did he just, like, unknowingly break his oath by accident? Oh, no. Why are you putting that down, Halbrand? Play nice. Oh, he's making me anxious. Don't end the episode there. Oh. Oh, he grabbed it. Brand. Wow! Oh, this is so beautiful! Come on, where is he? Where is he? He's there, isn't he? Yes! Oh, that's gonna be the last time she sees her brother, isn't it? I'm gonna cry, this music's so beautiful! I'm gonna have to cut so much of that out because of the copyright, but oh my god. That was stunning! That, that entire scene has just made me fall a million times more in love with the show than I already was. Oh my god. How can people not like this? Oh, look at him. He looks wonderful. He looks so good. Oh, the armor. Yes. Literally crying. That was absolutely fucking glorious. Jesus Christ! Holy good lord. That was... Oh my god, that that is the best fucking episode so far. Like, every episode for me has been top tier. But this is, like, top, 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 top tier. Like, that was fucking insane. So much happened. So much went on. We got to see, like, a little bit of, like, everybody. Um, And everything, again, is starting to just... It, it kind of started to like just go a little bit insane and now it's going even more insane like now they're all on their way back to middle earth and they all look absolutely wonderful and beautiful and the music oh my god the music this is like probably my favorite soundtrack like ever it's so fucking good i cannot wait to just go and have this on repeat um elrond being a sneaky little fucker being like well, you see, we're gonna all die, so I can't break my oath. So can you, like, do it for me, basically? I mean, oh, of course, Durham was gonna accept. He's, he's, in, like, he loves his best friend. That's, that's their relationship. That's what they do. It's exactly the same as Gimli and Legolas. They would do that for each other, 100%. Maybe not at the beginning of their friendship, but definitely, you know, they literally, like, sailed away to, like, live together and die together. You know what I mean? Like, they, they, like... They, they did that. Um, so, I mean, the, the friendship, the bond there is, I feel like, stronger than it would be between two elves. Um, like, two different, you know, races coming together and just... I don't know. It's just so beautiful. I love their friendship so much. Feel glad I'm a little bit, like, uh, suspicious. I get him. I understand him. But I'm just like... Come on, my dude. Um, the stranger, my boy, 
Gandalf, best boy. Um, Gandalf who's also not Gandalf, who I'm not really sure what's going on with anymore. Um, I really, really hope this isn't him, like, turning. Um, like, I know, obviously, like, the sort of, like, Adar and the Orc army and stuff, they're starting to, like, take over, and everyone's like, oh, Sauron's coming. So, I'm just kind of like, I, I don't want this to be him starting to, like, go and, like, realize what kind of power he has, like, turning water to ice and slamming into the ground and... Oh, I'm just so scared. I'm so worried. I I just want him to be safe and happy and I just want him to be protected and him to be Bessie with Nori and then later be besties with Bilbo and then be besties with Frodo and get angry at, at Pippin and, you know, it's just... Oh, it's so stressful. Um, But yeah, this was such a good episode. I'm so freaking happy. I'm gonna, like, rewatch this episode, like, a million times. It was so good. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it as well. Let me know what you think. Um, and I'm gonna leave comments open this time. Originally, the past couple of episodes, comments have been disabled until I review them. Um, but this time, I'm gonna let it happen, because this was a really good episode, and I'm really gonna be surprised if people shit talk it. So um please be nice please don't like you can you can not enjoy this if you don't want to that's completely fine just don't put your negativity onto me don't threaten me don't like say horrible things to me just because i'm enjoying it don't try and bring my mood down because that's really shitty um but yeah thank you guys for watching i hope you all enjoyed it just as much as i did i hope i'm not the only one who cried at the music um and yeah i will see you guys in the next video so peace